And President Buhari has reaffirmed his administration commitment to the development of culture, which will in turn strengthen historical values and background of different kingdoms across the country. The President's representative, the High Commissioner to the United Kingdom, was at the Palace of the Obar of Benin to perfect the paperwork of the official handling over of artifacts that were returned by Cambridge University and University of Aberdeen, Scotland. The artifacts were carted away during the invasion of Benin Kingdom in 1897. A correspondent, Valentino Sumbo, filed in this report presented from our studio. With this official documentation, the country's historical treasures of high cultural values returns to its rightful owner. The formal return of historical artworks to Bikini Kingdom signifies a breakthrough in the desire of Nigerians and indeed Africans to repossess the African artworks currently domiciled outside their places of origin. The Obar of Benin of Baiwara the second is full of joy that in his lifetime he's witnessed and the return of historical treasures scattered away for many years. We once again express our sincere appreciation to the President and Commander-in-Chief of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, President Mohamed Buhari GCFR. I would like to invite the appropriate authorities in Europe and other parts of the, of the world to partner with us in creating development programs for our youth in the New Kingdom and Nigeria in general. Dignitaries at the event have this to say. We are happy and uh, extremely happy to be here to share this day with my brother and others around us. Culture and tradition make an empire. And whoever knows the history of Benin Kingdom knows how strong and how varied the culture and tradition is. We don't want to remember, like the other said, the events that culminated in the disposition of the people of Benin Kingdom, of those artifacts. But we want to rejoice that over 100 years after, things are beginning to happen. So it's a great day for us. And for me, my takeaway is that time does not correct what was wrong. If you stole what does not belong to you, even over a hundred years, it remains a stolen property. And the only way to make up for it is to return it to the owner. And that has been done today in the case of this particular artwork, and I'm happy. With this feat achieved successfully, perhaps the return of the bronze works scattered away over 100 years ago may see the light of the day. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.